So with this uh, new move that Yule Doche is on to, uh, so me is always steps ahead. She has gotten updates spiritually about the activities of Yule Doche. Yule Doche has been trying and making all moves to find me. He, he has been making all the moves to find me. He wants them to meet face to face, have talks and discuss here and there, do whatever it is. But she has been, you know, cutting all means of contact. She has been trying to cut off from all of it. In fact, if not recently, that the court said you let each has to pay five million naira for upkeep every month. She has never contacted Yule Doche on behalf of their children for fees, tuition fee, or for upkeep or anything. No, never. So Yule Doche will not have any reason to say, I want to bring food. I want to bring this for my children. Yule Doche knows where Danielle goes. So if you want to go meet her to give her money, stipends, you can. You are Danielle's father. If she wants to take the money, good for her you know talk about birthday gifts and strange things that you let the child give me you know when this is thing became a big deal you let the child giving his daughter a very funny is it a figurine a statue like that so funny but that's all i want to talk about so me knew that you let doche is going to do everything to turn the tides around he will do everything physically spiritually he has been going for consultation to him this is more of a spiritual battle but the thing about people like this is this they don't see they care less to see the part the role that they are playing the part of what they have done or what they are doing that is detrimental to their progress. They don't see their mistakes. They don't see their mistakes. They believe that everything done by them is super, like, on point. They believe that life is on their palm. The world is on their palm. They can do and undo. They believe that there is nobody that has the right to tell them anything, even when they are the ones oppressing that person. They believe that you must accept whatever it is that is being doled out to you. You know those kind of persons. So, me has become more attentive to spiritual things. She has become more attentive because uh, if you say you do not want to engage in certain things, well, you'll be surprised that people will drag you. They will bring you into it. When you say, no, I don't want to be part of this. I don't care for this. I don't believe this one. I don't even have thoughts about this. Um, this does not matter. This is not even real. Um, I, I, this is not, you know, there are people who say, no, none of these things matter. None of these things are real. I, I live my life normally. I do my things normally. Um, I am this, I am that. People will teach you how. People will teach you how. How to engage in securing yourself. They will teach you how you will be forced to protect yourself. So, she was told not to be in contact with Yule Doche in any way. And that at this point, at this time, she needs to intensify her prayers. Imagine you marry a man and all of a sudden, this, this man has now become a prayer point. Not because you want this man back now. You're praying that this man does not become a tool 
that will be used to oppress you, to attack you. So Hewlett Richard has been going around, as you saw in the previous video, he has been going around giving out snacks, drinks, you know, biscuits and all of that to children. You know, you gather children, give them, gather children, give them these things. When people do these things, which normally if you are that kind of person without being instructed to, but in the case of Yule Duche, he has been instructed. Yule Duche went for consultation and he was told that he needed to turn the tide around, he needed to take action, and that the action that he needs to take will turn all the good luck, good luck, that ran away from him back to him. And that there will be a change, meaning soon, that is what he was promised. Soon, May will stop having this publicity, will stop having this, uh, uh, you know, attention. All of these things that look like good luck, like favor coming to her with Twinto. Because what Yule Duce has been told is that there must be a balance that uh, is the one that allowed himself to be this way. That regardless of what has happened, that Yule Duce needs to seek for spiritual balance so that me will not take away all his energy. So Yule Duce is trying to drag back, get back his own energy. They say, is it that there is a balance? Or you take more. I don't know if you guys are understanding what I'm saying. It means that Yule Ducha has been promised where he went to. If you start doing these rituals, you start giving out these uh, offerings, you've got our children, you do this, you do that, you are going to turn the universe in your favor and May will begin to lose that traction. She will begin to lose that favor. People will not concentrate on her. She won't be getting endorsement. She will be getting more of it. She will be able to live by. But she won't have this massive, you know, it's like an equilibrium, a balance. So they are trying to give a balance to this thing. But me knows already that something is about to happen. There's going to be a shift if she's not careful. It's not as if you may took something away from Yule Duche. No, but because both of them have been together, there is something about both of them until Yule Duche decide to go a different pathway. Now, the universe smiled on her. Yule Duche is losing. She's gaining. When Yule Duche went for spiritual consultation, he was told about these things. And they say, no, look, sit down. We have some spiritual mystery. We have, you know, this esoteric knowledge, deep insight, who realign you and rebalance you so that you too will begin to get your favors back. Well, let us see how this will turn out to be.